Hey everyone, this is Armani with Shereen and Shakia, and today we're going to be reviewing some upscale candles. Yeah, we have several different brands for today. One of the brands that we have is Lafco. We also have Nest. Diptyque. And we have Trap. So, what we're going to do is start off with the Nest Fragrance brand. And um, we're going to review today the actual standard candle, which is about 8.1 ounces. But what I really love about Ness is they have the most versatility as far as choosing which size you want. Because you can go up as high as the 3 wick candle, which is over 20 ounces. You can do the standard. Or you can go lower with the Votive size, which is about 2 ounces. That's this one here. Or you can even go um, even lower than that with a mini candle. But these ones, I get a lot of burn time out of them. I've gotten over 20 hours out of these little small ones here, which is really great. And they retail for about $16. The standards, which are the 8.1 ounce, they retail for about $40. And the three wick candle retails for $60 or more, which is great. Yeah, and if you're not going to the store and you're getting it online, you can get this right here. It's the gift set. It comes with six fragrances, well, six cents, and it looks like this. It comes like that. And you open it like this, little miniatures. Which is really mm -hmm. cool because it's around Christmas time, so this would make a really great gift if you want to give this to someone. Yeah. And um, I've gotten over the recommended burn time that they say because I've gotten over 10 hours out of these mini candles a piece. And they last like a really long time, so that's awesome. But as far mm -hmm. as um, the standard candle, which we're going to review today, um, that's these guys here. And I've been burning it for a while, so you can see that I've been using it. You can see. Okay. But I'm going to start with the um, tangerine. The tangerine scent has some mango in there. It has passion fruit in there with the um, tangerine essence. Wow, that smells amazing. Give it. And when you burn it, it's even more intense. It smells like summertime. Yes, it smells good. It does. What it gives you is a crisp feel. It feels like you just cut open a uh, grapefruit. And it's very tangy, but not overly tangy. So it's just a really awesome and amazing scent. It's something that's great for like an energy boost. If you're waking up in the morning, you're not really a morning person. So this scent is really great for all those things. Um, I also want to talk to you about the burn time and the lingering. With that particular candle, even when I, um, the next day, I still smell it. It's still lingering. And the um, tangerine scent is really amazing as well. It's citrusy too, but I feel like it's not as strong. How do you guys feel about that? Than the it's like tangerine, but that's yeah. not a bad thing. Yeah. Why do you think it's not a bad thing? Which is not, but you can smell it when you're relaxing. Yeah, because everybody likes different things. Some mm -hmm. people love strong scents. Some people like scents that are more delicate. So that's why it's up to you whether or not you want something stronger or not. So it's still really cool. And one something I can tell you about these is sometimes when you buy candles, when you first burn them the first two or three times. You smell it and it's great, and then after a while you don't smell it anymore. This is why it's okay to pay for the uh, more expensive ones like Ness, because you smell this candle from the first time you burn it to the last time you burn it. The smell never fades, so it's a wonderful bang for your buck, which is really cool. Um, as far as the attractiveness of the candle, what do you guys think as far as the look? I like how the white theme is in and outside the candle. Yeah, she says it looks a little chic too. It has a little it's logo frosted. on it. Yeah. Right, and the it lines on it. decor really cool. well. Yeah. And what's um, cool about this is that these repurpose amazingly. So if once you're done with the candle, you clean it out with some soap. And these ones, which I love about higher end candles, they clean out easily. All you have to do is um, clean it out with some hot water. Put some hot water on whatever wax is remaining and it's going to come right out. Wash it out with soap and then you can use it for whatever. And this is so beautiful. And they clean up so well. So Ness is a really great way to go. And with a lot of the higher ends, they only you only can get like the 20 ounce or more or a 3 wick. And then you're spending the automatically $60. But with Ness, you can get the standard size. Spend $40 and have a beautiful luxury candle. So that's why it's wonderful that they're so versatile as far as what size you buy. So when if we had like five stars um, and that was the rating system, I would give this, in my opinion, five stars. Because it actually lasts 
as long as it says it does. It's extremely beautiful. It burns even. Look at this. It's been burning and it's just a perfectly even looking. You see that? So that's really cool. So that's why I would give it five stars. What do you guys think? I would give it four. Only because it's very simple and it's not very unique. And More decorative. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And how about you? Four and a half. Okay. So she's giving 4.5 stars. So that's mm -hmm. great. So everybody, um, if you can, check out the Nest Candles. They're wonderful and they're amazing. So what we're going to do next is the trap candle line. As you can see, my mom stepped in. Mm -hmm. and she wants to be a part of it today. So with the trap candles, which is really cool about them, is that they're 7 ounces, which is a wonderful size. You get about 50 hours of burn time with these ones. So that's kind of cool. So let's just talk about the scent. Mom, tell me what you think about this. This one is the lavender, and I've been using it, as you can see. <laughs> what do you think about the scent? Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, I smell it. This is very strong. Very yeah. strong. Yeah, it, it hits you right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The smell. This lavender, you know what's cool about it? Is a lot of people say that it's a lavender that men could like too. So this one has like a unisex scent where women love this lavender, but men could love this lavender too. Because it's like a toned down lavender or like a cologne sort of lavender. Like, I mean, that's the best way I can explain it to you. So you, that's what's really you, you awesome. You can give a strong, uh, small smell through the home. Right. Like, right. cool point, Mom. Which my mm -hmm. mom is talking about is how it lingers throughout your entire house or your room. So you can smell this throughout the entire home, which is totally yes. true. Mm -hmm. And then the next one, I got the um, orange vanilla, which is an extremely popular scent from Trap. Oh. And I've been using this one. What do you think, Mom? Mm. Oh, my God. It smells so delicious. Oh, the yellow, the, the yellow in it look, looks nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like a, um, if you were like on an ice cream truck and you got like an orange sickle with the cream inside, doesn't it kind of smell like that? Like an orange sickle? Yes, popsicle? yes. Yeah, that's, what, that's exactly what it smells like. And as far as attractiveness of the candle, what is more attractive than this packaging? Isn't that cool? You know what that reminds me of? What? I don't know why, but it looks like a Chinese kind of theme or something. Like a little China house. Like, I don't know. But um, this, is, this makes a nice gift too. Trap is an extremely popular brand that a lot of people like a lot. So you can get it like pretty much anywhere. And it's like a little perfume in every candle. That's what it says around the, across the front. And it kind of feels like that too. So these ones burn extremely even, which I love. They're extremely attractive, beautiful. They have a long burn time. But the price point is great. Because these retail for about $25 to $30. So they're affordable. Mm -hmm. So that's great. So if I were rating these, I would give it, in my opinion, I would give these about, uh, I'd say 3.5 stars because um, I love the scents, but they're not as, like some of the more higher end ones, to me, they smell a little better, which was these ones, they smell great, but more like a standard kind of good. So I would go with like 3.5 stars, which is really cool. So if you want something, though, that is a medium price, that's really luxurious still, beautiful, lasts a long time, mm -hmm. go with Trap as opposed to, because I love Bath & Body Works, but these are more luxurious and they're around the same price point. So why not get something much more elegant, which yes. you're going to get with the Trap Both candle. Yep. So this is a wonderful lot and they have a lot of fragrances. So that's my review of the Trap candle. Thanks. <laughs> hey, okay, now we're going to review the Detit candle. This is how it looks here. Yeah, these ones, um, they come in about uh, 6.5 ounces. And they also have middies. Of mm, the, as soon as you open it up, you can smell it. Yeah, you can smell it like, in the box still. That's how it looks. That's the roses. I've been burning that one for a while. And then this is the bay, which is extremely mm. popular. This is rose? Yeah, that's rose. Wow, it smells just like a rose. <laughs> yeah, it's like mm. a, a fresh... This is like if you just pick a fresh bouquet of roses... This is what it smells like. And I also have a, a, a Yankee candle in roses, but it's different from this one. Whereas the Yankee is a little more artificial and a little bit too strong. Whereas this one, it really smells like a rose and it's not overbearing, which is really cool about it. You get about 60 hours. The cool thing about the, the teak candle is I've been burning this for a while. Mm. And this is, Look how it hasn't even gotten that low. Right. Wow. And it's perfectly smooth. 
It doesn't get all rough or bubbly or anything like that, which is uh, awesome. But um, the the bay smells like it's it's uh, basically a bouquet of roses, but it's sweetened with black currant leaves. Mm, so it's like berries with, in there too. Mm. That's the difference. Oh wow. Okay, it do smell like it's berries, so it's berries mixed with this. Yeah, and you can actually smell that in there, which is cool. These ones last super long. That's why I love this brand. So some people feel like, wait, it's only 6.5 ounces for $60. But you got to factor in something. It takes a long time to burn this candle out. It lasts super long, so you get that value out of it. That's what's cool. As far as like the attractiveness of it, what do you think? I don't know, it's creative. I like the words on it, how it's written. Let's look at it. It's cool. Like and it's beautiful. It's all in different places. I like this. And these repurpose extremely easily. So you just clean them out with soap and water. Hot water. Cleans the wax out. And you can put your makeup brushes in it. You can put whatever you pretty much want to put in here. And so you can still use it in different ways. If you take the label off, you can even use it as a glass. Mm -hmm. I like to serve like alcohol. Just stuff like that. So and. As far as how I would rate these, I give this a perfect four stars because it really burns extremely even, especially if you take care of it, keep trimming your wicks, everything like that. Um, it lasts a long time, especially if you dip the wick when you blow it out to extinguish it. Um, it's extremely attractive and it, you get a lot of bang for your buck. So they are higher end, they are expensive, but in my opinion, they're worth it. I mean, you, you just love this. Like, yes, I do. I like the rose one. Yeah. And I'm a huge fan of Bay, But it's really up to you. So that's our review of the Dittique candle, which is really, really amazing. Five stars, people. Five stars. Worth that $60 for 6.5 ounces. So what we're going to review next is one of my all-time favorites, and that's Lafco. This is the Lafco. Last but not least. Definitely not least. The chamomile lavender is what Look how big the box is. It's huge. Wow. This one, the presentation mm, on it is yes. a, a wow. Because when I first got it, I was amazed. It's huge. It's beautiful. Imagine getting this as a gift. Let's bring it closer Look to it. Look camera. how I got it written out. You see that? The label. Beautiful. Look like a little gift box. You see how it's wrapped? Look at the black. Like a, if you put a bowl on top, boop, that's the gift right there. Wow. <laughs> This one, this is the uh, the line where they have one for like every room. So this one is the master bedroom candle, but you can use this in your living room too. It's really cool. This is from the house and home collection. So this one is a really large candle. It's six, um, 16 ounces. And these retail for about $60. You get 90 hours of burning time, which is a lot of time. Oh, wow. Yeah, a lot of time. And as far as attractiveness, so this looks, one looks at, at this one. beautiful. Let's put the actual wax in the camera. So, you know. And I've been burning that for a while, and that's all that's gone. Nice and smooth. Beautiful. So what do mm. we think of the scent? Mm, what's this one called? Um, that's mm. chamomile lavender. Oh, wow. It smells awesome. This is my favorite scent. If you love lavender. Then this was a different kind of lavender. This puts a different spin on lavender. It's relaxing. Mm -hmm. They describe it, it as... Sleep. It will put you to sleep, and it's like if you take a bath, this is so luxurious and just relaxing. It's warm and enveloping. It's a mix of sweet chamomile and um, sprightly lavender. It's like a stress reliever. It promotes yeah. well-being. Oh, okay. So that's what's like really wonderful about it. The jar on this one is beautiful. Like um, I repurposed one. I'll show you. And I just put like my um, candle tools in it, my wick dipper, my trimmers, and stuff like that. Because it's so easy to clean out and repurpose. So that's cool. This one is true. Yeah, it's true that you get 90 hours out of it. You get, I, I think you get more than that, actually. I think they under they undersell so that when you actually burn it, you're like, wait a minute, that was more than that. Right <laughs> yep, and this one self-extinguishes, which is really cool because that's a safety thing. So once it gets down pretty low, it, it stops lighting on its own. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. It's like a safety mechanism, which is wonderful. That's pretty cool. And that avoids fires and things like that. So you will notice that after a certain point, you can't actually light it anymore because mm -hmm. it detaches on its own like that. So this one, for me, is a five-star candle because it's so amazing. It lasts a long time. The smell is out of this world. 
It's extremely attractive. This is soy and a paffron blend. And these are hand-blown vessels. So those are the soy candles. Okay. It's a blend, yeah. Oh, a blend. And it's a hand-blown vessel, which is uh, super cool. So what is it blended with? Soy and what? Um, paffron. Oh, okay. Awesome. So um, how many stars are you giving LAFCO? I'm going to give this a five. It is. It's a five-star candle, people. Thank you so much for watching our video today. I want to thank everyone who you've seen pop in and out of the video. <laughs> you see my mom popping in on out. today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, we did. And we wanted to get different family members involved in, in their opinions. Yeah. So we had our niece, Armani, who you saw earlier. Me. My wonderful sister. <laughs> And our mom, who even though she has a, a speech problem, she was able to vocalize herself. And she just loves candles. She started burning candles now, too, because she got her into it. it. I got mm -hmm. her into it. So I hope you enjoyed these videos we did for you today. Um, the luxury high end candles, they're worth the price, people. They're amazing. Give them a try. Thank you so and much. That's nice for giving for Christmas, which is coming up. Christmas, yeah. Get me. She knows what to get me for yep. Christmas. Laugh out. Laugh out.